Welcome back to the channel. Today you're joining me with the Honda E and we're here to fit some two-piece discs. We're going to see if we can improve the handling, efficiency and the performance. With the Honda E when it first came to us we were looking at ways that we could improve it. Um, coming from performance background we wanted to look at the suspension, the brakes. So naturally we put a set of our own brake lines on there. That helped with the pedal feel. IBAC helped us with the spacers and springs so we've got an overall improved stance on the car. And one thing that we developed ourselves was a set of two-piece discs. Now this is to reduce the unsprung weight and hopefully the suspension is going to react a little bit quicker and give us the efficiency and the performance that we'd be hoping for there. So I've covered around 20,000 miles in the car now and one thing I'm noticing is the brakes aren't seeming to wear. With all the regenerative braking that we're getting on the car, the around town sort of wear and tear on the brakes is just not really there. You know, I can probably see these going on to do 30 or 40,000 miles. So I'm not going to hang around and wait for these to wear out anymore. We're going to cut straight to it, get these discs on and see if we can get any performance upgrades from the car. I've got discs off the car now, so we're going to have a little measure up, see uh, where we're at, if there's any sort of weight difference in them. So to start off with the fronts, standard fronts, and um, like I said, you can barely see any wear on that, it's, it's not even lipping up, um, but we'll weigh it up anyway. It's not going to be exact science, obviously it's not brand new, it has seen a very little bit of wear, but to start off with, we've got a front weight of 6.13 kilos on the front original disc. On the rear disc, we're going to have a weight of 3.8. So 6.1 and 3.8, then moving over to what we're going to be putting on the two-piece. So on the front here, we're zeroed off on the scales, got 5.24, nearly a kilo difference across the front disc there. Uh, onto the rear, I'm not expecting quite so much, I can already feel you know, there's not as much weight difference in this one. Got 3.47, so Overall on the rear, we're probably looking at about 400 grams difference um, on each corner. There we have it, two piece discs on a Honda E. Now I'm going to get driving it and see how this actually performs on the road, whether we do actually see any increase or not, or whether I've just wasted my time. But either way, we're quite happy with how it's gone. It looks really good. And if you like the video, hit the like, share and subscribe buttons and feel free to leave us a comment below.